So I want to go over this problem today and uh, try been trying to practice more. So the question is, find a date with the highest total energy consumption from Facebook data centers. I'll put the date along with total energy consumption across all data centers. So what we got to do the first, obviously, we got to connect all the tables. So we'll go ahead and do that. And I think what the uh, there's many way. I mean, there's plenty of ways to connect it, but I think the way this uh, problem wants to do it is with the uh, union. So we'll just do with the union, which is the simplest way, really. So we'll go ahead and do it. We'll do select all from. Let's see. I'm just going to be copy pasting because I'm too lazy to type. So this is going to be the first step. Then we're going to drop it in the union. And then we'll just go to select this and do this. Okay, and so we have one more table to union, and we'll do it like this. Let's check. Okay, everything seems to be working just fine. Good. So now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this into a subquery, and I'll be selected from the subquery because I think it'll be the simplest, really the simplest way to reduce my um, uh, the steps to get to where I want to. Do. So, you know, to find a solution. So this is how, now, let's call this hubcore just A. And um, so what we'll do is we'll select just all from now, just to make sure everything is working. Actually, I got to put subquery's name. So it'll be like this, and I'll then be from, and then this is our subquery. So this is where it's going to be selected from. All right, so far, so good, it's working. So now, Okay, so what we need is the date and consumption. So we'll go go ahead and do sum, since we need total consumption, right? So it will be sum of A con, con, I'm struggling, consumption. And then we'll select, you know what, let's do us total. And then we'll do uh, a date. All right. <sighs> Let's see if it's gonna run by itself. Yeah, well, it's not because we need the group by. There's no group by, so it's not gonna run. So we'll do a group by. We'll do date. Let's see if it'll run. Okay, it's running now. Okay, so we got what we need, and now we just gotta do. Order by, let's see, uh, what am I ordering by? Order by total. This is because we need that two highest, two, two total descending. So now it's all a nice order by the amounts, not dates. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna drop by, I think we need two top dates, limit two, and boom. All right, they should be good. So first, what I did was just make a sub query where it joins all the tables together. So now that I have that, I'm pretty sure there's probably a way of doing this without making a sub query, but I think it'd be just a little bit too many steps to kind of work around. It's probably, I'm probably gonna get a lot of errors and the way I see it, it be just the simplest thing to do, just join them, put them in one, one, you know, I just make them into one table and then just select from it and select what I want from it, which will be a total consumption and the date. And then just simply just, you know, order and filter through it essentially from top to bottom, from the highest to lowest value, then just limit it by two and it will be, uh, your final solution. So we can take a look at what they did over here, which is completely crazy, to be honest. Like this is com complete insanity. The way they solved this, I don't know, it's just a lot of steps. It's a whole lot of steps, let's see. So they did a sub query as well. And then I did another sub query. Uh, that's a lot of steps to, to get to what you want to do. I don't, um, yeah, I mean, 
it's really up to the user. There's a lot of ways to interpret this. I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of a lot of ways people did it in different ways. Yeah, a lot of steps. I just <laughs> I opted off. I guess the laziest solution. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's take a, a last quick look. So one table, subquery, and then just select from it what you need and just filter it out by from highest to lowest amount, then just limit it by two and you get what you need. All right, and that's it.